Hey there everyone, in this video I want to show you how to unlock your Sprint iPhone 10. Hello everyone, welcome to Cellular Pros. In this channel we do tech reviews and tutorials, so if you're new to the channel I welcome you to subscribe. Alright, let's go right to the video now. Okay, so this iPhone 10 right here that we have is from Sprint. And I'm going to be showing you a quick method and an inexpensive method to unlock it. This is currently, uh, at the moment, the only method right now to unlock uh, iPhones from Sprint. It's by using this unlock chip that you're going to see here. Alright, so I'm going to go ahead and show you really quickly. Uh, so as you can tell, this phone is uh, it's activated here. Let's go ahead and remove the SIM card. All right, so as you can see, it's a Sprint SIM card. All right, so let's go ahead and put that down and put another SIM card into it. So I'm gonna be putting in a T-Mobile SIM. So you can see what it does when you try and un uh, unlock it and use it with a different SIM card from another carrier. So this one is T-Mobile, let's put it in here. So check out what happens. It goes to this activation required screen and uh, you pretty much have to connect to Wi-Fi, so connect to Wi-Fi and uh, you're gonna have to try and get the phone activated with the SIM card that you uh, inserted. Okay, and it's gonna give you this message, SIM not supported, because the SIM card is not from the uh, carrier that the phone is from, so since this is a Sprint phone and it's locked to Sprint, you can only use Sprint with it, okay? So I'm going to show you now how uh, we're going to unlock it. So uh, let's remove the SIM card tray with the SIM card ejector tool. Okay, and what we're going to do is, let's put the T-Mobile SIM card down for a second. What we're going to need is unlock chip that we have here. It's a unlock SIM. I'm going to have a link in the description down below where you can find it. Okay, so what we're going to be doing is uh, we're going to place the chip like this. We're going to place it with uh, this little uh, s part right here that sticks out under. So you're going to place it like this and that part is going to go under the metal uh, frame of the SIM card tray. And the slanted part on this side. There we go. And just make sure it fits in there like that correctly. Okay, and then all we're going to do is get the T-Mobile SIM, place it on there. Okay, it's going to look like this. Okay, so I'm going to be putting in a T-Mobile SIM card, but you can uh, use any GSM SIM card that you want to use. So go ahead and place it in very carefully, gently. Okay, so follow very carefully now the steps I'm going to explain to you so that we can uh, get it unlocked with the unlock chip because now we're going to have to put in a special code in order to unlock it. So go go ahead once again and hit uh, continue once you're connected to Wi-Fi. Or if uh, it allows you with the cellular data network. And once again, we get the SIM not supported uh, message. All right, but uh, now I'm going to show you what we're going to do to uh, unlock it and uh, make it work. So you're going to tap and hold the power button. And this menu down here is going to come up. So hit emergency call. You're going to hit uh, star 5005, star 762, 7672, I'm sorry. And then pound zero, I mean star zero pound. So just like that. And then once you have that in there, hit dial. And you're going to get this menu right here. Just scroll down to edit ICC ID. Okay, and then here is going to be the uh, number that you're going to type in. And then one thing to keep in mind, this number changes very frequently lately. But once you put it in and you leave your SIM card in there with the unlock chip, you're not going to have to change it anymore. Uh, the only you know, reason you would have to change it is if you remove your SIM card. So it's going to be 8901. And I'm also going to have this number down in the description. 
four one zero three two seven nine five oops two seven nine five two nine one five and then five four six eight and then hit send and it's gonna say set up okay so here hit accept okay and then once you hit accept we're gonna have to power the phone off and power it back on or you can also uh, eject the sim card and push it back in but I prefer to reboot the phone okay so once the phone is completely powered off just uh, press the power button and power it back on just go ahead and hit continue And there we go. This time it's going to uh, activate the phone and bring you to the main screen where you can begin using the phone again. And as you can see, it's reading the SIM card and picking up service. Um, let's go ahead and make a test phone call. 1-800-COMCAST. Welcome to Comcast. There you Home go. Of so as you can see, uh, it is dialing perfectly. It's picking up signal. Let's turn off Wi-Fi really quick. So you can see that it's also uh, getting data as well. Let's go to cellular data on. It says LTE. So let's go to Safari. Let's go to Google here. Google. Yep, as you can see, it's picking up the data as well all right and uh, so the good thing is that once it's unlocked and once you put in the sim card uh, the phone is already unlocked so you can use it with any other sim card that you want to use and you don't have to put in that code anymore all right so let me go ahead and show you let's go ahead and remove uh, the T-Mobile sim card so as you can see the unlock chip is in here let's go ahead and uh, remove the T-Mobile sim uh, and let's go ahead and place the AT&T, for example. All right, so once again, it's going to go to the activation screen at first. Update complete. So hit continue. I'm probably going to have to connect to Wi-Fi again because there's no data service now. Oh, it looks like it automatically connected to Wi-Fi. And there we go. It, like I said, it automatically bypassed the activation and uh, activated the phone with the AT&T SIM card as well. So um, there we go, guys. I'm going to have a link down below in the description where you could buy this unlock chip. And I'm also going to have the most up-to-date code uh, that you need to use to unlock it with the sim in the description down below all right everyone so that's it for this video i hope you enjoyed the video and i hope it helped you out if it did please give it a like it really helps the channel out a lot so that's it for now i'll see you around in the next video and as always peace ciao